Hey everyone, uh, if you're like me, you really like the um, Egret Tours Marina Settlement, but get really annoyed about the big gaping hole in the side of the main building. So I've uh, come up with a way to, to fill in that hole in the walls. Um, now, I think it works quite well. Um, it, it takes a bit of messing around, but... It, it doesn't look too bad. Uh, now it's done the same way as you do the roofs on the sanctuary houses uh, by using the building it first and then using the, the, the concrete pillar to, to glitch it into the roof. Uh, as you can see here what I'm doing is I've made a, a, a tool, a snapping tool basically uh, just stacking the, the floor pieces on top of each other to give me a way to snap exactly in the same spot every time. Uh, now in order to do this what you'll need to do is you'll need to uh, stack the floor pieces four high. Uh, I've actually gone five and you'll see why um, because when you go to actually glitching it into the building um, it has to sit up just a little bit higher because you've got that junk balcony that sticks out the side of the building um, and what will happen is it actually sits on top of the stairs that are on that that junk balcony um, so for this to work it is a little bit odd looking but rather than having big holes in the one the floor and the roof and the walls uh, I think it works quite well um, I'm, I'm happy with it it's taken a little bit of stuffing around and sort of learning how to actually do it but uh, as you as you can see here I'm uh, now doing what will actually be the floor um, so I've got the the quarter floors stacked three high and I'm adding one of these on top and you'll see that I put the stairs on the third row up so one lower than the actual floor of the um, the building and if you don't do that you end up with a gap at the bottom of the stairs that you can't fix uh, so I think this works just a little bit alright uh, so what I'm doing is I'm just finishing off the actual floor itself uh, so what you want to do is on that far edge you want to do it four four wide by three wide um, and that's sort of the cutout of the uh, the existing stairwell of the um, the building and then I'm just putting in two walls now one of these walls actually covers the stairs on that little junk balcony and the other one will actually cover the windows like I'm, I'm not too fussed about the windows being covered but you, you may not so all you really need to do is one in each from a one in from each corner and then using the half uh, walls there uh, and you'll see why because when you complete this section when it comes to doing the roof and that front wall on that angled wall what will happen is you'll end up with a big gap uh, so I just use those half walls just in order to um, just to fill in any gaps and then the roof all you all you really need is um, three by three oh two by two sorry um across the top um now what i do here with the uh, concrete the the triangle shaped floor uh is because i think it would look a little bit odd having a square roof poking out over the top now i know i've done that with the floor but i think the floor doesn't look too bad and I'm actually going to be using that spot for um, a turret so rather than trying to glitch in a, 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 a shelf or whatever onto the wall I'll just use that and the, the end result it doesn't look too bad so uh, again once you've built the, uh, the structure you use the, the concrete pillar to raise it up uh, now you will need to sort of raise it up as high as you can 
and then add another pillar uh, just to get the height right. Uh, as you can see here, I've, I've got it all sort of ready. Uh, pick it all up and take it over to, to where you want it. Now, this bit is a little fiddly. Uh, it took me quite a few tries to, to sort of get it in. Um, but I was lining it up with the, the far right corner and using that front edge on the right hand side uh, to sort of try to just get it so it sort of looked good but I was also keeping an eye on the left hand side right on that roof corner bit um, so it, it takes a bit but you do do eventually get it um, now I will advise that you make sure you just go down as far as you can um, due to those stairs um, now you'll see what happens if you haven't quite got it lined up um, so I, I end up placing it but then I go on the inside and I, I check to make sure everything looks alright um, now don't get rid of the concrete pillars yet don't move them because if you haven't lined it up properly you will need to pick it back up now I was trying to sort of push it inside the wall slightly uh, but as you'll see here, the stairs hang just over the edge, uh, which I, that doesn't look too bad. But uh, as you'll see, I'll go back outside and I um, I straighten it up. And there's the reason why I, I stacked all the floor pieces. If you don't, you end up with a big gap, which I tried a few different ways to cover that gap using the uh, the junk railings, that sort of thing. But it just didn't look right so I thought if I stack the floors at least then it's solid and it doesn't it doesn't sort of look too too out of place uh, as you see here I sort of moved the wall out slightly now I was originally thinking it might be sitting outside the wall but but it's actually not now uh, which is, is sort of what I wanted uh, so we'll go back upstairs and you'll see here the stairs are just inside now, I don't think that looks too bad. Uh, I use the wooden stairs because I don't actually mind the wooden stairs. But you could use the concrete stairs um, or you could try other stairs, see if you can get them to fit in and they don't look too bad. Now, there's that, that edge of the floor that's poking out that I, uh, I'm i actually going to use that for a turret um, and it saves me trying to uh, dick around and, and get something onto the wall. Now, with the gap that's left at the front on that angled wall, uh, what I do is I go over to the the, the uh, warehouse walls with the windows in them, and I place down the two, and then I use the pillar to actually glitch one inside the other. Um, as you'll see here, what I what I try to do is I try to line up line up the the window panes the um, the framework of the windows I try to line them up because on the other side they'll look exactly the same uh, so it's just a little bit of messing around sort of getting that that into place so it sort of looks like it's, it's supposed to be there and any imperfections once the decoration and everything's completed uh, you won't see that um, and because we're, we're repairing the walls and we've got to use these glitches in order to do it I don't think it ends up looking too bad now here you'll actually see the moment I realized that I've actually made a mistake uh, if you notice I've actually got the pillar on the back of the wall um, and I do I do eventually realize that I've done that but it takes me quite a while to actually realize that I've done it uh, as you see here I'm still going I'm still trying to pick it all up yep there we go and look at that I've got it all oh hang on wait yep that's the moment I realized so move the pillar start all over again and again for some reason the uh, the pillar didn't want to work the the bottom pillar just didn't want to sit in the right place now <clears throat> I know there are mods that that fix Egret Tours Marina. Uh, I have downloaded one, and it didn't seem to work. the uh, The doorway 
was kind of messed up and you couldn't actually use it. Um, and I know there are scrap mods, uh, and I have tried this with the scrap mod installed, but for some reason it, it makes it so the building, it's like it's not actually there. Uh, you can't actually glitch anything in, you can't place uh, items on the second floor. Uh, so I, I've had to uninstall those, I mean, I will install them again once I've done this. Uh, and get rid of all, uh, get rid of that, um, that, that balcony there because it, it's kind of useless with a wall in front of it. But it, it just makes it so you can't use it. Um, but I don't think this comes out looking too bad. I think this is a solution that I'm happy with. Uh, and if you find it helpful and you use it and, and you think it works for you, please leave me a like and a comment. Uh, please share and subscribe and I hope I've helped other people because I've actually looked on YouTube and have not been able to find anything about fixing fixing the walls. Uh, no Respawn, Star-Lord, who do very good buildings. Uh, they, haven't, they haven't done anything that I've found, uh, so I thought I would do something and it might help out others and if it doesn't help you, I'm, I'm very happy and thank you and have a good night.